Welcome back, boys and girls. And I have another great story for you today. The title of the story is Snow. The author and the illustrator of this story is Manya Stojic. Owl ruffled her feathers. The snow is coming, she said wisely. I know snow. The geese were gathering. S -s -s snow they said with a shiver. Our lake will freeze. And don't you worry, boys and girls, because their feathers will keep them nice and warm. Yes, the snow is coming, said Moose. I can smell it on the breeze. Does Moose look happy to you or does he look sad? I think he's happy. He has a smile. Does everyone see his smile? Oh, snow. Bear yawned. Time for me to be sleeping. Who knows what it's called when the bears sleep for a long time? What is that called? It starts with the letter H, boys and girls. Hibernate. Yes. How many of you got that right? Good job. Hare snuggled her bunnies. Winter brings snow, my honeys, and our white coats. Oh, what a sweet picture. Oh, snow, said Fox. Those clouds are full of snow. The forest was still. It was covered with a sparkling blanket. Isn't this a gorgeous illustration, boys and girls? The trees covered with snow. My fur looks like fire, bristled Fox against this white snow. We are as white as we can be, giggled the bunnies, white as snow. Cute little bunnies. Snow, snow, so sleepy, mumbled Bear as he drifted into dreams. I love the crisp air, sniffed Moose, just after it snows. South, we'll fly south, honked the geese. So long, snow. The snow will stay, said Owl. But one spring day, it will drip, drop, melt away. I know snow, she said wisely, but I sing spring. The end. Did you enjoy that, boys and girls, as much as I did? I hope so. Why don't you get paper, pencil, crayons, whatever you have, and draw a picture of your favorite part of the story. And I will see you again real soon, okay? Bye-bye.